In tonight's Consumer Alert, a Senate report released this week is urging the government to crack down on airline fees that are often unfair or hidden from consumers. The report is based on an investigation by the Democratic staff of the Senate Commerce Committee. It says there appears to be no connection between the price of checked bag fees and the costs incurred by the airlines that impose the fees. The Department of Transportation has the power to investigate and prohibit unfair or deceptive practices in the airline industry. The report recommends the DOT investigate whether bag fees should be tied to actual costs incurred by an airline. Lexus, the luxury division of automaker Toyota, may be changing the way it sells cars. Beginning next year, about a dozen Lexus dealers in the U.S. will start a pilot project where the prices for new and used cars are set prices. There's no negotiating. If a customer doesn't like the price, the salesperson must be willing to let the customer walk away. The move is a bid to appeal to millennials and Gen Xers who Lexus says simply aren't willing to negotiate on prices like their parents did. The general manager of Lexus expects the program to be successful and roll out to more dealers in 2017, but doubts that all 236 dealers will embrace the set pricing. Best Buy's website will start to carry one more product that's sure to get some attention. Best Buy started selling the Apple Watch on its website today. The big box electronics retailer is the first national third-party retailer to offer Apple's wearable device. The Apple Watch will be available soon in 100 Best Buy stores, but as many as 200 stores are expected to carry it by the holiday shopping season. Coming up tonight,